If you want to become an SEO optimized content machine, you need to watch this video all the way till the end. A lot of people think it takes an enormous amount of time to create a lot of content, and that can't be further from the truth. You can create 60 pieces of short form content using two hours of your time per month, and you can create four long form videos using an hour and a half of your time per month. You can now have 64 pieces of SEO optimized content going up on autopilot and bringing you inbound leads with minimal effort on your part. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can do it. The first step is coming up with the content ideas. So one thing to keep in mind here is you have to come up with content ideas that your target audience is actually searching for, because there's no point in creating content if nobody's gonna see it. Now you're probably wondering, how do you do this? You need to use a tool called vidIQ. It's a keyword research tool that's been around for years now and I've been using it myself. You can validate your content ideas and check the competition and the search volume. Ideally, you wanna find videos that have high search volume and low competition. This way you can rank at the top of the search bar. YouTube is the second biggest search engine. There's so much traffic that goes there every single day. And there's so many content ideas that have such low competition. It's literally free digital real estate. You need to think of each video you're putting up as digital pieces of real estate. These videos take up a spot in the search bar until the end of time. This way you can keep getting inbound leads. And eventually if for some reason decide to stop making content, you're still going to be getting views and inbound leads. Once you've validated your content idea through vidIQ and you're sure that there's high search volume and low competition, the next step would be to create an outline for your video. You do not want to script the video word for word. This is the worst thing you can do. It's gonna take you five times as long to prepare the script and it's gonna take you three times longer to actually record the video. Why do that when you can record in a fraction of the time and make it feel more natural? Open up a Google Doc, put the video idea at the top and start writing bullet points. The only thing that you actually wanna write out word for word is the hook because this is the most important part of your video. Ideally, you should call out your target audience and give them a value prop as to why they should watch the video all the way till the end. From there, you just want to create a skeleton, literally just bullet points, no more than one sentence per bullet point. At the end, you want to make sure you include a CTA and also some actionable advice that they can take away. Now, the second step to becoming a content machine is actually recording. So you need to get in front of the camera, look at those bullet points and start riffing. It's as simple as that. Over time, you're going to get so good as to where you won't even need a script. You'll just have a content idea and you'll be able to just create a video. That's exactly what I'm doing right now. Ideally, if you're recording a long form video, your raw footage should be somewhere between 15 to 20 minutes long, depending on how many pauses you're taking, because you want the final product to be between eight to 10 minutes long. That's the perfect length. Now that you've recorded the video, it's time for the most time intensive part, post-production, also known as editing. If you've been editing videos since you were 12 years old, like me, it's probably gonna take you anywhere from 14 to 17 hours to edit the video if you're doing high quality edits. But if you're just doing simple things like cutting out the ums and the ahs, it's probably gonna take you an hour or two. Editing is probably the most annoying part because you have to keep watching the video over and over, make sure you don't miss anything. The audio keeps playing in your ears and it's super annoying. If you wanna outsource this part, I'd recommend against getting a freelancer because they tend to have mistakes and also they don't have your best intentions in mind they're just trying to edit the video as fast as they can and get your money and get out but if you outsource to an agency they'll literally take care of everything from a to z they're going to hand you the content ideas on a silver platter you go record for 20 minutes come back give us the footage we'll edit it we'll make the thumbnail and we'll do all of the youtube seo completely done for you you'd be able to make four long form videos using an hour and a half of your time per month and you'd be able to make 60 short form videos using two hours of your time per month so if you want to become a content machine that's seo optimized and actually gets an ROI, hit the first link in the description. Now the next step is to actually SEO optimize your video. So to do this, use a tool called vidIQ, get the Chrome extension, and then once you go to upload your video, it's gonna give you an entire list of recommended tags to use. You wanna fill it up all the way to 500 characters and make sure you include your full name as a tag. So my name is Eamon Arab, so I'm gonna include that in the tag section. That's one thing that boosts you to 50 out of 50. Most people don't even know that the description plays a huge role in your search engine optimization. You need to fill up the description with keywords and 
and use the same keywords that you used inside of the tag section inside of the description. You want to take all of the tags and rewrite it in a paragraph format and put it into the description. From there, you can also add a transcript of the video, but I would only recommend doing that if it's a short form video, because if it's a long form video, it's going to be way more than 5,000 characters. And finally, for the title, you need to make sure it's less than 50 characters. That's one thing that Mr. Beast always does, because what happens is when someone is watching the video on a mobile device, if it's over 50 characters, you're not going to be able to read the full title. One more thing, you need to triple the keywords. So you need to take one good keyword and triple it in the title, description, and tags. So when I say triple it, it means make sure that one really good tag is present in the title, tag section, and description. Now the last part is the thumbnail. You need to aim for a click-through rate of at least 8%. If you have an 8% click-through rate, that means that if 100 people see your video in the YouTube search bar, eight people will click it. If you have lower than 8% CTR, you're doing something wrong and you need to change the thumbnail immediately. Here's what makes a good thumbnail. One, you need to have a bright background. Two, you need to have clear text that is clearly differentiated from the background. And three, use less than four words in the whole thumbnail. And five, you need to put your face in the thumbnail and preferably if you can over exaggerate an emotion, you'll get way more views. And I'm not saying don't do any clickbait like surprised faces just do something normal where you can clearly tell if you're happy sad surprised etc now you want to schedule the video for a weekday the time that i've found to work the best is either 9 a.m eastern time or 5 p.m eastern time this is because if you put it up at 9 a.m people are going to wake up and see the video but if you upload it at 5 p.m they're going to see it after work Another good time to post is 12 p.m. Eastern time because that's right around when everybody's eating lunch and they're on break and they're watching videos. That's everything you need to know on how to become an automated content machine for long form content. And for short form, I'm gonna give you guys a couple tips. You wanna take 20 minutes of your time to prepare 60 questions, and you wanna also add some hooks. This is probably gonna take you about 30 to 40 minutes total, including the hook. From there, you wanna set up the camera and just record. Make sure you're recording vertically at 1080p and 30 FPS. An iPhone is good, and if you can get a tripod, that's even better. If you wanna take it to the next level, you can also get a studio light. You can easily get a three pack on Amazon for 40 or 50 bucks. How it works is you want to have your phone pulled up right in front of you recording vertically and then on the right you want to have your scripts and when I say scripts I mean the questions and the hooks. You want to read out the question in your head and then say the hook and then free flow from there off the top of your head. This is how we're able to create 60 shorts using two hours of our clients time every single month. They can literally record for two hours, pass us the footage, we'll edit it, and we'll SEO optimize it. To quickly recap over everything I just said in this video, first, you wanna come up with content ideas that people are actually searching for. So get content ideas that have high search volume and low competition. Second, you wanna open up a Google Doc, type out the content idea. You wanna write the hook word for word, and from there, you wanna only use bullet points. The next step is to record. You can record a long form video easily within 20 to 30 minutes. And then the next step is to edit the video, but ideally you're outsourcing to an agency. After that, you wanna SEO optimize the video, make a thumbnail, and schedule it for either 9 a.m. Eastern Eastern, 12 p.m. Eastern or 5 p.m. Eastern. And then you want to go and create 60 shorts using two hours of your time and make these the top of your funnel. You want to SEO optimize every single one of these videos as well so you can take over the search bar. That's it, everyone. But real quick, if you want five new clients or you don't pay, listen up. I'll literally come into your business and implement a content operating system that operates without you. All you have to do is record for a couple hours per month and I'll tell you exactly what to say and all of the content ideas. I'll take all the videos and convert them into written pieces of content. So that's tweets, threads, auto DM giveaways on Twitter, LinkedIn posts, even emails. I'll nurture your entire audience and I'll grow your audience completely done for you. All you have to do is record for a couple hours a month at that. So once again, if you want five new clients or you don't pay, hit the first link in the description and that's it. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike and that's it. Peace out.